So we are now heading to Dharamsala, Himachal Pradesh to get the blessings of His Holiness Dalai Lama of Tibet. And this is the bus that we are boarding tonight. It's going to be leaving around 8.30 p.m. this evening. Guys, currently it's 4 a.m. in the morning and we have just stopped somewhere here and it's 12 degrees Celsius outside. We are expecting to reach around 5.30 a.m. hopefully. Ramsala visit is good. This is the place. Guys, check this out. Place in Ramsala. Close the door. This is the beautiful view from our place in Dharamsala and it's now 7.30 this morning we have just managed to reach at the hotel Such a beautiful view of Dharamsala. Guys, I'm here at Dharamsala. Uh, it's 7.44 this morning and as you can see, the sun rising. Beautiful view of Dharamsala. Enjoy this vlog of Dharamsala. <laughs> Good morning guys from Dharamsala. So this is yummy Tibetan breakfast brought by our brother with some eggs, cheese spread and some Tibetan tea and sweet tea mm. and some jam. Oh thank you so much. Just want to acknowledge brother for brother and sister in law for bringing all these morning yummy breakfast for us guys so this is Tuklakhang guys so here we are at the Dharamsala main center where a lot of Tibetan administration offices are located uh, this building is Sheri, Sheri Lego and here we have got 
uh, one of the new construction going on, the Tibet Museum. They are building the Tibet Museum. Beautiful view of the mountains. Wow, all these Tibetan offices. Looks amazing. And guys, now we are here at the as we are here at the Tibetan Parliament. The Tibetan Parliament in exile. Tibetan Parliament in exile. Mountain view from Macleod Gunch. Beautiful. Guys, now we are heading towards the Library of Tibetan Works and Archives. <laughs> Guys, this is the view from the top of Macleod Gunch. A lot of Tibetans residing here. Very beautiful place. And it's a very sunny day today. The weather is just perfect. Couldn't be more grateful. Guys, we are now heading towards Dasa, the main town of Dharamsala. The market and the town is mostly occupied by the locals of Himachal Pradesh or Dhamsawa. So yeah, we are heading down there with me and my family. Alright guys, we are now here at Nordulinka. <laughs> Their hours are 9 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. And the restaurants are 7 to 9.30 p.m. They've also guided tours and art workshops, so on. Very nice, it's a beautiful place. It's got their own restaurants as well.
beautiful uh, museum at Nobelinka showcasing all the Tibetan culture. This is Miller Pan. He was an 11th century yogi who became famous for his ascetism, high realization, and beautiful poetry. He meditated in caves, living only on metals, seldom distributed by outsiders. One day, a frightened deer, pursued by an angry dog, followed by its even angrier master, burst into his cave. The hunter was Kirap Gompa Doji. Milarepa quelled his anger, bringing him in peace of mind through his profound and beautiful sound songs. Guys, this is a Nolim restaurant outside, and it's really beautiful. It's got a beautiful view, and it's a nice place to sit and have some lunch and snacks with your family. So, guys, with that, the tour of Nobulinga ends here in Dansala. Beautiful view from Maximus Mall, Damsala, Himachal Pradesh. this morning and now we are heading towards uh, Chopema which is one of the sacred Buddhism Buddhist lake here in Himachal Pradesh India so yes come with us to the 
to Pema Lake. So guys, what we just saw is a sort of here. Another day here and we are on our way to Sopema. breakfast, aloo paratha with some yogurt and some chutney and eggs, boiled eggs and very hot Indian chai. Hello, welcome to New Zealand Tibetan Family Channel Vlog. Today we are here at Dharamsala and we have come to Sopema Lake. So now we are going up to Sopema. It's a beautiful morning. This morning we left our place from Dharamsala at quarter past five in the morning yeah I would technically say five o'clock but we left around quarter past five and then uh, the journey took almost five hours uh, thankfully the driver was quite punctual and yes now we are going to Sopama In fact, it's so peaceful here. There is a beautiful temple on mountain. 
All right, so guys, we are heading inside William Pucci's cave. We are in Dharamsala. Another steep cave. So guys, we are now here at the small town of uh, Lake Pema, also known as Tsopema. Guys, this is the beautiful Lake Pema, Tsopema. Simply amazing. Again, guys, thank you very much for watching this video. This is the last spot for the day which is so so beautiful as you can see behind me the lake is beautiful and there's a lot of monkeys here hello monkeys
This is the beautiful lake Sopdema that we intended to visit today and it, so far the trip has been amazing and very fulfilling. On the top again we have a very sacred Guru Rinpoche statue and it's a great blessing for the people of this place to have such a big giant stupa of Guru Rinpoche also there must be a lot of thousands and thousands of fishes in this lake as you can see the government has strict instructions not to feed the fish because we don't want to kill them by food poisoning This is the beautiful town of Maklot Ganj. Dharamsala and it's nine o'clock in the morning and the sun is shining beautiful view of Dharamsala <laughs> Guys, during our Dharamsala visit, we stayed at Kelsen Guest House. It's on the Maklut Ganj and it has got beautiful views and the rates are very reasonable. So if you do happen to come to Maklut Ganj, do visit this Kelsen Guest House. And thank you to the owner. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, finally the day has come to say goodbye to Dharamsala, Maklot Ganesh, Himachal Pradesh. This evening we are leaving by bus and our bus leaves around half past eight. to Delhi. Ram Dalal Travels. You can also book them online through www.ramdalaltravels.com. The bus is comfortable and spacious. Hoping to reach Delhi by tomorrow morning.